Progressive Waste Solutions Single Stream Recycling System located in Tampa, Florida, manufactured by Green Machine. Mixed materials collected from residential and commercial accounts are deposited on the tip floor in Tampa and then loaded into a Green Machine metering bin feeder system. The metering bin feeder system then deposits a metered homogeneous mixture of recyclable materials onto a inclined Z-pan infeed conveyor. This material is then deposited upon an elevated pre-sort system where bulky non-recyclable items are removed. The green screen OCC separating system automatically removes bulky cardboard from the recycling mix. The OCC separator system separates material by size, first removing a five inch minus cut of primarily glass, flattened tin, flattened plastic containers. These difficult to separate materials are then transported to a green screen mini polishing system. The mini polishing system then separates the fiber materials from the difficult to separate flattened container materials. Cardboard passes off the end of the OCC screen and is then deposited on the tip floor for future bailing. The remainder of the recyclable materials, primarily fiber and three-dimensional container materials, are then transported to a full-size green screen polishing system where fibers and containers are agitated and fiber is pulled to the top of the screen depositing the fibers onto a post sort conveyor allowing containers to fall off the bottom of the screen. The post inspectors inspect the material for non-recyclable materials allowing clean number eight news to discharge onto the tip floor. The container materials and certain contaminants that are discharged off the bottom of the full-size polisher are then transported to the green screen mini polishing system where again fibers are pulled to the top of the screen and an inspector removes any non-recyclable materials. Both conveyors deposit a clean number eight news to the tip floor area where loaders are then able to push the clean number eight news into a baler feed pit which feeds a baling system which produces highly densified cubes of material for shipment overseas or domestically. Containers and fines that are removed from the bottom of the screens are then transported up to a green machine glass breaker fines removal system for further separation. Attached to the end of the green machine glass breaker is a fractional air knife fiber ballistic separator system which lifts full size paper and light papers out of the container mix and deposits that material on a fiber recirculating conveyor carrying that material back to the fiber post sort area. The green machine glass breaker system then breaks all glass 
and removes all fines from the waste stream, depositing that material into the bunker shown here. This material is then transported off-site to a secondary processor who separates the glass from the fibers, recycling both the glass and fiber. The container stream is then transported to a patent-pending Green Machine Green Eye Optical Sorting System. The Green Eye Optical Sorting System identifies PET plastic, primarily water bottles, removes that plastic material with the use of high-pressure air jets, lifting that material off of the belt and depositing that material onto a secondary conveyor which then deposits the clean PET bottles to a separate holding bunker. Here we see the PET plastic deposited in the holding bunker while, again, post container inspectors are responsible for the remo removal of three dimensional fiber materials such as phone books and cardboard boxes and additionally remove remaining plastic bottles including milk jugs, detergent bottles and three through seven mixed containers. Further down the line both ferrous and non-ferrous materials are removed magnetically automatically. Any residue which deposits off the end of the system is rerun through the system in a closed loop so that no residue leaves the premises. <laughs>